Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and of course we continue our Speed Up Your PC series that has to do with making your PC faster but without having to reinstall Windows. So uh, one of the things that you could also try in speeding up your PC and sometimes it's also going to speed up the startup is checking out what are the apps that start up with your PC when you actually start it. Right click on the taskbar in Windows 10. You can right click on the start button in Windows 11 and go into the task manager. Once you're here, you have a tab at the top called startup. What you want to do is remove the majority of what is here that starts with your PC. There's a lot of things you don't need that start up with your PC. So you could, of course, <clears throat> click on them, disable them, but only disable the stuff that you know you don't want and you don't want to use. So you won't, for example, disable your security um, software. So anything that has to do with your antivirus, you don't touch you will stop anything that you want disabled at startup. So Skype, I use it once a week. I don't need to have it start automatically every time. So choose what you want to disable and click the button to disable it. Keep, of course, important software enabled. For example, I keep the OneDrive enabled for one reason. I want it to back up the files automatically. I keep the Windows security notification because I want to really know what's happening with my antivirus. I don't care about Cortana and I didn't, don't want to have an edge browser that starts in the background, although it makes it faster. Uh, a lot of apps actually use the startup for the purpose of just making it faster when you need it. You might notice that some of the apps that you're going to stop here are going to take a longer time to load when you actually need them. But if you don't use them every day, the good news about it is that this will prevent them from actually starting up and using some you know, uh, background power and slowing down your system. The more you have things running in the background, the slower the PC. And the older you have a PC, the more this will actually show on the speed of your computer. So if you're not sure what to, to remove here or to, to disable, uh, you can disable just one at a time restart your PC, see if everything's all right. And if something does happen that you don't like, well, you'll, you know, you'll be able to remember uh, going back here, which one you want to enable, because you'll know about doing it one by one, you will know which one was the last one that caused the problem that you see. There rarely is any problems in actually disabling uh, stuff here. So, you know, don't worry too much about it. Uh, in general, it's actually a good idea because it's going to make your PC faster, especially on older machines. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up, and thank you for watching our videos.